spring. This is it, y'all. This is it. Did you hear me? No. What? Look. Hospital. This is where we get off. Let's go, kiddo. Oh my god, and we didn't even have a horse, did we? Did we really walk? <laughs> you feel that breeze, huh? Oof. Duh. I tell you, on a day like this, I Holy just sit shit, on my porch. Holy shit, this is so fucking Take gorgeous. Like yeah, you know, once we're done with this whole wow. thing, I'm going to teach you how to play guitar. Yeah, I reckon you'd really like that. What do you say, huh? Um. Forgive us. Oh, we're so close. I dreamt about flying the other night. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Go on, tell me about it. So, I'm on this big plane full of people, and everyone is screaming and yelling because the plane's going down. So I walk to the cockpit, open the door, there's no pilot. I try to use the controls, but I obviously have no clue how to fly a plane. And right before we crash, I wake up. I've never been on a plane. Isn't that weird? Yeah. Well, you know, dreams are weird. That is true. <laughs> yes, they are. Cat Katarina Parrot Parrich? Another city, another abandoned quarantine zone. There it is. There's that hospital the Firefly mentioned. Come on, kiddo. Look at those mountains in the background, dude. Stunning. Maybe we cut through here, huh? Oh, I think there are supplements over here, actually. <gasps> We're doing it! Yeah. Now we talking, baby. Well, we could use that ladder. Lucia, we made it to the quarantine zone. I wanted to call you, but all the phone lines are down in this city. They told us that they can deliver letters between the different zones, although it will probably take a week or two to reach you. We're in good spirits. Hannah talks about you a lot. She really misses you. I'm surprised at the calmness and maturity she's shown throughout this craziness. I feel like I've been the emotional one. I find that she's comforting me most of the time. We've raised her well. I hope all is well on your side of the country, and I really hope to hear your voice soon. Love, Graham. We didn't have a clue yeah, back then. Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, you just kind of seem extra quiet today. Oh, sorry. No, it's not... It's fine. It's because the journey's almost over. Here we go. She feels weird about it. 
probably. I don't know. Ellie. Probably thinking like, what's Ellie. gonna happen? What? And the ladder. Come on. Right. What this is gonna mean for humanity? Lots to think about. <laughs> Another Rivers Cafe. Oh. They had a lot of those uh, in, in Pittsburgh. Oh my god. <laughs> what is it? Ellie! Ellie! You gotta see this. What is it? Slow down, kiddo. <laughs> Come on. Hurry up. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, Damn. Everything you were hoping for? It's got its ups and downs, but you can't deny the view, though. So serene and peaceful. And then that's all gonna get thrown down the drain. So let's do this. We don't have to do this. You know that, right? <sighs> What's the other option? Go back to Tommy's. Be done with this whole damn thing. After all we've been through. Everything that I've done. It can't be for nothing. At this point, why wouldn't you do it? Look, I know you mean well, but there's no halfway with this. Once we're done, we'll go wherever you want, okay? Well, I ain't leaving without you. So let's go wrap this up. Book 10. Ellie, I think I found another Fuck. one of those comics you've been reading. Book nine, Precipitate. 
The time has come for Daniela's second faster than light test flight. This time the mission is not exploration, but infiltration. This time Daniela is going to. Their payload, a 20 terra teraton anti-carbon bomb. Their crew, eight of the most capable, suicidal, and dangerous men and women of the last watch. Their mission, the annihilation of the Traveler homeworld. This place takes me back. How so? It was right after everything went down. I ended up in a triage just like this. And everywhere you look, you just saw families torn apart. The whole damn world seemed to have turned upside down in a blink. Is that after you lost Sarah? Yes, it will. I can't imagine losing someone you love like that. Losing everything that I know. I'm sorry, Joel. It's okay. Whoops, my bad. Should have paid more attention to that. How did we get 16 bullets? Huh? <gasps> Tools! Level 5! Final level. Let's go! Another map. Map of the Salt Lake City Quarantine Zone. Handwritten notes across the map indicate locations of evacuation routes, the hospital, and areas with no supplies left. Alright. I actually have no idea how many parts we have. Not much. Great! Let's do piercing. Oh my god, we're gonna max this gun out. Let's go. And that's all we can do. Yeah, all right then. Good. something for you here Maria showed this to me and I uh, I stole it I hope you don't mind you try I guess you can't escape your past <laughs> thank you
Okay, here we go. <laughs> this, this is going to be fun. Be different. I just know it. What do you mean? They're going to be there. The fireflies. I'm sure of it. They didn't hear me, did they? Okay. Uh, so definitely gonna ignore the bloaters. I don't get that. It doesn't make fucking sense. Oh my god. Well, that's so stupid. Like, I don't know what I'm doing wrong there, to be honest with you. I feel like in the original it was not like that. Could have been so avoided. Unreal. Not moving. Always does this at the worst times. 
I want to get the clicker first. up there. Ellie, get on up there and drop that crate for me. Okay. Oh God.
What the fuck was that? Here we go. All right, just stick to the edge. It's shallow over there. Book 10. I'm just going to stick with it until it is. 13. Uh, catalysis? Wait, have, why do I forget how to say that word? Cat... Catalysis? I don't know. Faced with the failure of their mission, Daniela and James chose to make the ultimate sacrifice for humanity, flying the ship and the anti-carbon bomb on it straight into a neutron star. The resulting explosion was the single most significant astronomical event since the formation of the galaxy, destroying the Traveler fleet, their homeworld, and countless other worlds and star systems. But will the sacrifice of two of humanity's greatest heroes be enough to break the Traveler's iron grip? No, now that I think about it, it makes a lot of sense that Ellie's into that because she's into, like, space. She's she's into that sci-fi stuff because, you know, she wants to be an astronaut. Oh, freezing. <laughs> I bet. All right. Give me a foot. I should have shot the clicker first. All right, I'm going to do that. Get that door open. I'm gonna do that ASAP so you don't even have to worry about it, girl. Uh. Like. Look out! Uh, you okay? Yeah. Three shots? I mean, shit. You just surprised me. Oh, I, I can't wait for I tried to, to be kill it before it. Yeah. My bad. Workbench? I know we got a shift door here though. There you go. Oh, that's got me worried. Was kind of weak. All right, let's do this. I think this is the last workbench, isn't it? So you really gotta be careful here. Power. Yeah. Because when we used it on those two guys, it, uh... I feel like I, I had to use up a lot of it because it didn't do much. And then we'll do... Fire rate, I guess. Okay. That should help us out. Watch your head. Okay. 
Yeah, we need to get that pallet. on it. Ooh. All right. Get on. Okay, there. Come on it. Be careful. I got you. Beautiful. broke off the wall. Now what? Uh, I'll figure something out. Yeah. Problem oh, solving one oh one. Jump. You're gonna catch me? I got you. See? You didn't even need me. Let's get the hell off this thing.
Hands in the air. She's not breathing. Hands in the fucking air. Come on. <laughs> Welcome to the Fireflies. Sorry about that. They didn't know who you were. And Ellie? She's all right. They brought her back. <sighs> you came all this way. How'd you do it? It was her. <clears throat> she fought like hell to get here. Maybe it was meant to be. <clears throat> I lost most of my crew across in the country. I pretty much lost everything. And then you show up and somehow we find you just in time to save her. Maybe it was meant to be. You don't have to worry about her anymore. We'll take care I of her. I worry. Just let me see her, please. You can't. She's being prepped for surgery. The hell you mean, surgery? The doctors tell me the cordyceps, the growth inside her, has somehow mutated. It's why she's immune. Once they remove it, they'll be able to reverse engineer a vaccine. A vaccine. But it grows all over the brain. someone else there is no one else listen you were gonna show me where <clears throat> stop <clears throat> I get it but whatever it is you think you're going through right now is nothing to what I have been through I knew her since she was born I promised your mother I would look after her then why are you letting this happen because this isn't about me or even her there is no other choice here March him out of here. He tries anything, shoot him. Don't waste this gift, Joel. Get up. I said get up. I said, move. Give me an excuse. Which way? What the fuck are you doing? Keep walking. I said, keep walking. <laughs> Where is the operating room? I ain't got time for this. Where? Where? Top floor, the far end. He is a man on a mission. The smuggler, he's in here. All right, here we go. Oh, I think the weapons are glitched again. Yep, I can't switch them. Why does it fucking do that? Hey, okay, whatever. Shit. 
killed Ethan. What? Ethan's dead. We got a man down. The smugglers escaped. Locate the target and eliminate him. We'll search the other floors. Yes, sir. Search the floor. Find that smuggler and shoot him on sight. Oh shit. Another one down! <laughs> Still good. <laughs> All right. gonna do it yeah Oh no. Shit. 
Another body! Keep looking. <clears throat> Me either! What was that? I feel like I'm actually doing pretty good. I think I did that whole thing stealthily. I don't think I've ever done that before. Alright, you know what? Fuck this. Oh god, that's nice and recoil. Oh my god. Light is so fucking bright! That gun kind of sucks. Isn't there a third one right over there? He just didn't want to join the party? Oh shit, here he comes. We'll stealth kill this guy. Come on! Wasn't anybody else? Marlene was right. The girl's infection is like nothing I've ever seen. The cause of her immunity is uncertain. 
As we've seen in all past cases, the antigenic titers of the patient's cordyceps remain high in both the serum and the cerebrospinal fluid. Blood cultures taken from the patient rapidly grow cordyceps and fungal media in the lab. However, white blood cell lines, including percentages and absolute counts, are completely normal. There is no elevation of pro-inflammatory cytokines, and an MRI of the brain shows no evidence of fungal growth in the limbic regions, which would normally accompany the prodrome of aggression in infected patients. We must find a way to replicate this state under laboratory conditions. We're about to hit a milestone in human history equal to the discovery of penicillin. After years of wandering in circles, we're about to come home, make a difference and bring the human race back into control of its own destiny. All of our sacrifices and the hundreds of men and women who've bled for this cause, or worse, will not be in vain. What do we got? Bryony Stewart something. My God, this is a good one. Whoa, that's a lot. Okay, March 15th. <clears throat> we finally crossed the Utah border. In a couple of days, we'll be back with the others. Today, the crew has... Today, the crew was in much better spirits. I've been worried about their morale since Greg and Tanya's passing last week. It's good to hear them laughing again. Robin came up to me and said, Thanks for watching over us, Marlene. It was a small gesture, but I needed it. March 23rd, Ellie never made it. We arrived at the hospital. There was much celebration, at least from the others. I guess they're happy to see their old friends. We haven't seen some of these guys in over 10 years. After they told me the news, I couldn't eat. I couldn't talk to anyone. I should be grateful to just be alive, but right now I just want to shut my eyes for a bit. March 24th, they look at me and I know what they're thinking. That we're a bunch of incompetent grunts. What was I supposed to do? I thought I was going to die. My men were being hunted by the entire Boston battalion. I had to get her out of the city. How was I supposed to know the Firefly escorts were already dead? God damn it. I panicked. In the end, I healed pretty damn quickly, and my men were more capable than I gave them credit for. More than a handful survived the army's attack. I should have kept her with me, instead I handed her off to a couple of smugglers. I failed you, Anna. I failed all of us. I am an incompetent grunt. April 25th. I can't stand talking to any of them. I don't think I can take the stairs any longer. No way I can stay here. April 28th. One of our scouts just radioed in. He spotted an older man and a young girl entering the tunnel by the bus terminal. He thinks she might have had red hair, but he's not sure. What if it's her? Stop doing this, Marlene. The recon squad is about to head out. I'm going to join them. April 28th. When you're lost in the darkness, look for the light. She's alive. They're running the tests on her now. I can't tell if I'm excited, scared, or just nervous. All I know is my hands won't stop shaking. I thought there was like an, a recorded thing in here now. Maybe I'm tripping. Okay.
is this guy? He brought the kid all the way from Pittsburgh. That's all I know. My even sister was supposed to meet him this night. I did. This is how we're just gonna take every single one of them out. <laughs> it's gonna be a pile of bodies. Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, when you see two bodies in the same spot, you probably shouldn't walk to it. I'm just gonna throw that out there. how to do this without getting seen. Huh? What the hell is that? I mean, this is the only way I can think of. What else was I supposed to do? Fan out. There's only two left. Uh, right here. So fuck it. Uh. Shit. Let's go, Bucko. Here's a recorder. Hey, Anna. It's been a while since we spoke. I, uh... I just gave the okay to proceed with the surgery. I really doubt I had much of a choice. Asking me was more of a formality. I need you to know that I've kept my promise all these years. Despite everything that I was in charge of, I looked after her. I would have done anything for her, and at times, I... Here's a chance to save us. All of us. This is what we were after. What you were after. They asked me to kill the smuggler. I'm not about to kill the one man in this facility that might understand the weight of this choice. Maybe... he can forgive me. Oh, I miss you, Anna. Your daughter will be with you soon. 
damn. What are you doing in here? I won't let you take her. This is our future. Think of all the lives we'll save. No! no. Fucking animal! Carrie, shut the hell up! Wow. You guys are all gonna burn in hell! Jesus. Oh god, oh. All right. Come on, baby girl. I got you. I got you. Oh, shit. Let's get out of here. Rammed her head into the wall. I got him on my flight. Sorry, sorry about that. Get back. Oh, oh my god. Hey, come stop. Can't save her. Even if you get her out of here, then what? How long before she's torn to pieces by a pack of clickers? That is, if she hasn't been raped and murdered first. <laughs> it ain't for you to decide. It's what she'd want. And you know it. Look. You can still the right thing here. She won't feel anything. Still wearing off. What happened? We found the fireflies. Turns out there's a whole lot more like you, Ellie. People that are immune. There's dozens, actually. I ain't done a damn bit of good, neither. They've actually... St they've stopped looking for a cure. I'm taking us home. I'm sorry. Just 
come after her. God damn. Like rolling the sleeve like back rolling. down. Oh my god, that's so fucking funny. <laughs> Should be a straight shot through here. All right. Wow. There's that's so many beautiful pretty, views in this game. All right. Now watch your head going through. my age now. <laughs> I don't think I ever told you, but uh, Sarah and I used to take hikes like this. I think, uh, I think the two of you would have been, would have been good friends. I think you really would have liked her. I know she'd have liked you. I bet I would have. Book 10. Fuck! 14. <laughs> Singularity. The travelers have been crippled, for now. Daniela's daring plan and her seemingly miraculous escape back home have made her a galvanizing figurehead to the last watch. Captain Ryan's sacrifice has made him a martyr, an illusion Daniela won't dispel. But how long can she keep what really happened a secret? A little bit further now. So this is Jackson, where Tommy is. Back in Boston? Back when I was bitten? I wasn't alone. My best friend was there. And she got bit too. We didn't know what to do. So... She says... Let's just wait it out. You know, we can be all poetic and just lose our minds together. I'm still waiting for my turn. Ellie. Her name was Riley, and she was the first to die. And then it was Tess. And then Sam. None of that is on you. You don't understand. I struggled for a long time with surviving. And you... No matter what... You keep finding something to fight for. Now, I know that's not what you want to hear right now. Swear to me. Swear to me that everything that you said about the Fireflies is true. I swear. so good literally guys my favorite game my favorite game what an experience and the remake oh my god it looks so good oh my and uh we are gonna be playing the dlc left behind um we'll probably 
probably just play the whole thing in one video, most likely. Um, and that, that DLC's good, it's alright, but it's, it's not comparable to the main game, I will say that. And then, um, we'll probably take a bit of a break before we start The Last of Us Part 2, uh, because I want to start Forspoken and, um, the Dead Space remake, so, um, so yeah, we're, we're probably gonna wait a bit till we start the, the second game, but, uh, I don't know, we'll see, you never know. Um, thank you guys so much for joining me on this journey, it's, uh, it was a good one, and, yeah, Left Behind DLC up next, so thank you guys so much for watching, if you enjoyed it, please like and subscribe, I will see you guys in the next one.